Welcome in Riga at the Eurovision Party 2016 and with us now is the hopeful and the ambassador from Switzerland, Raika. Actually, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Raika, you're from Switzerland or from Canada? From both places. I was born in Vancouver, Canada, mm -hmm. but I'm a Swiss Canadian. Well, we had this before, a Swiss Canadian, uh, not, not Swiss Canadian, but French Canadian, Celine Dion, she, she uh, won for Switzerland back in 88. She did, yep. Have you been able to meet uh, Celine? No, but no. I would love to. Okay, so uh, are you still uh, having roots in, in Canada? And I, I read about you that you came from Vancouver initially. Yes. Are you still yeah. living there? Or? I live in Switzerland right mm -hmm. now. But okay. I mean, with uh, I'm always traveling for shows and everything, mm -hmm. so I'm always going everywhere. And uh, but, but how, how did it happen that you are a Swiss person living in Canada? Uh, my, grand, my grandfather was born in Switzerland. And in Canada, I mean... I grew up going to the Swiss Society of Vancouver. There's like a whole bunch of Swiss people who do crazy things back in Vancouver. And I, my whole family was really a part of it when I was growing up. So I feel really Swiss. Did, did the, well, this is the test we're going to do right now with you. Uh, do you speak Switzerdeutsch? Ein bisschen. Ein bisschen. Ein bisschen. Yeah, ein bisschen. Yeah. A, a little, ein bisschen mehr. Ein bisschen mehr. Um, I mean, mein, mein Großvater kommt aus Baselland. Mm -hmm. And ich bin ein Schwitzerin. Yeah. So. Uh, so this is the real proof that, that she's is Swiss. Uh, it's proof. Proof, proof. Uh, now let's let's talk about your musical background. Uh, how did the idea come up to for you to sing at the Eurovision Song Contest? And tell us a bit about your musical history. Um, I've been uh, a musician for about ten years, full time. Okay. So singing and writing songs, and I started with guitar, and um, I've been touring around a lot through Europe and through North America. And uh, now I have uh, I have a new record, and it's a pop record, my and first pop record. So and what is it called? It's called Beatitudes. Okay. Beatitudes, and it's is that a, the album? it's coming it's an out. Album? Yeah. Okay. It's a whole album. What what type of music is it? It's going to be like the last of our kind. Uh, will it be on there? Yeah. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's like alternative pop. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, living in Canada, of course, uh, growing up. Oh, when have you left Canada? When? I I don't really look at it like that. I kind of I don't know. I'm kind of. Always everywhere, yeah. but right now I'm spending most of my time in Switzerland. Okay, because I never well, really left. I'm still kind of there. I'm still <laughs> kind of. I'm right here right now. I don't know. Um, uh, was after the the music in Canada and the music in Switzerland and Europe. So uh, in Canada, which artists were you, are you looking up at and say, oh, "This is why I want to become a singer"? In Canada, oh, when I was young, it was Nelly Furtado. Yeah, mm. when I was like a like a teenager, I was like right in front of Nelly Furtado show and mm -hmm. just like. It was so it was so cool for me. And and in Switzerland itself, you, uh, what is is big there at the moment? Uh, Swiss music. Um, you know, I listen to I listen to a lot of different music mm -hmm. from everywhere, and I'm I'm really inspired by my peers and everyone around me mm -hmm. making music. So. Uh, so it's now, hard to say, you know. <laughs> let's talk about the uh, national final, the Swiss national final yeah. in, in Kreuzlingen. Uh, how did it come up that you say, okay, I'm going to put a song in and uh, hopefully I will be the one that's going. Yeah. Uh, how did the idea come up? I just, I just feel like it's like a natural progression for me because I have this record that's, mm -hmm. uh, that's ready f to come out and it's a pop record. Mm -hmm. And I'm, I just felt like a, like a natural, the natural thing. So it's more when like it like a promotional uh, um, pos uh, opportunity you've been well, using uh, now well for this. Well, not only, one. but mm -hmm. of course, I mean, we're all, we're all trying to get our music out, and mm -hmm. it's it's and just then, uh, it's an amazing experience and promotional, and you meet so many nice people. Exactly. So. But where will you be going next on the promotion tour? I think this is the first one. Yeah. In Riga, um, and then tomorrow we're going to Moscow. Wow. Yeah, it's my first time going everywhere. To Russia, amazing. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. And then Amsterdam as well? Yeah, yeah. Amsterdam and uh, Tel Aviv as well. Fantastic, fantastic. Yeah. That, uh, you will enjoy, make so many friends. And so you, today you met yeah. uh, already eight of the other contestants. Yeah. What's the feeling? Uh, it's a, about it's that? a love feeling. Mm. It's a big love feeling. It's like a bond uh, of the Eurovision artists and the fans. And yeah. this, is so, this is nice. And share that moment and treasure it. It's, yeah. it's very, very nice. Yeah. Uh, what? Will you be, or how will you be preparing yourself for Stockholm? Um, I do a lot of visualization, so like just visualizing the stage and visualizing everything. Mm -hmm. um, but also, it's it's a really nice time for me to to really go back into my voice mm -hmm. and to like look at every little part of it. Mm -hmm. It's really, it's. I mean, I don't think I sing a lot. I sing all the time, but I I don't really. 
I feel it's a really special time to go mm -hmm. back and really look okay. at everything. It's really cool. And uh, can you tell us a bit about the staging of the song in, in Stockholm? How will you be performing it and what will the clothing be? Is that already decided? It's a secret. It's a secret. Come on. I know. You're <laughs> like, no, come on, tell us. Um, I'm really inspired by nature all the time. So okay. I think that really shows okay. that. Okay, so that, that, that comes, uh, comes yeah. up the hint there. Yeah. Uh, Raika, all the best of luck for the song uh, that's called Last of Our Kind. Yeah. Uh, we haven't talked about the song, actually. We should do that, ah. too. Tell us about the song. What is the message you want to try to bring across to the people? Um, the Last of Our Kind is standing up. It's about standing up for love and not making decisions out of fear. Mm -hmm. And sometimes doing the more difficult thing yeah. and making yeah. decisions out of love. Okay. Yeah. Have fun at Eurovision Song Thank Contest 2016 at the pre-party as well. And after Eurovision, what are the plans? Oh, I'm going to release the record and tour. Tour uh, through Europe tour. or more Switzerland? or um, Hopefully everywhere. I have a band, okay. so hopefully we'll go on tour all over Europe and all over North America and as well, wow. all over the world. <laughs> wow, fantastic. All over the world. So what's, what's the band called? It's Reika. Reika, so it's, it's like so Reika. You're I have, the, the yeah, leading we're voice? We're a band, yeah. Excellent. Will yeah. they be coming to Eurovision as well to, to be on the stage? No. Oh. no. So it's, it's just you on in it's that case? It's just me, yeah. Wow, that's yeah. amazing what you can find out when we chat it to each other. Yeah, yeah. I didn't know about the band, so this yeah, is really yeah. good. Thanks so much. All the best of luck at, at the Eurovision 2016. Also for your career that's coming up afterwards. Thanks. And I'm sure you have good people uh, yeah. taking care of you, yeah. like your ma manager there from, yeah. from, from, from Switzerland. Have fun. Thank you.